y'all doing? It is Sunday. It is early on a Sunday for me. It is 9 39 and it is cold. It's in the 30s. Feels like it's in the 20s. We're gonna go do some grocery shopping. Now I did go to Costco and I didn't show y'all because Nick was with me and there was some family stuff going on. I needed to, you know, hurry up. But I bought my dog food like I always do. I bought some Tyson chicken tenders. I bought some of the uh, little dumplings. They were on sale. And I bought some frozen broccoli. Because I just haven't had any in the freezer. And I was debating to get the fresh or the frozen. But for the same price, you get more in the frozen than you did the fresh. So I went with that. So that's what I got there. So I don't need a ton of stuff, right? Because I've got a lot. I need to go through the pantry. So we might do that. And I just did a sort of clean out of the refrigerator. I didn't clean it. We're going to do that. Um, but I cleaned out the stuff that I know needed to be removed. The expired stuff, the leftovers. We didn't eat that kind of stuff. So I did that. So now when I come home, I need to like scrub the refrigerator because it's been a minute since I did that. So what I did was I went through the major grocery stores. I'm not going to go to HEB yet because it's a little further over there, so I might do that a little bit later. But we're going to go to Kroger, and I think we might go to Albertsons. And then if I need anything extra another day, I'll go to Winco. But I'm only picking up what's on sale. Kroger, I went into a Kroger, and they were super busy. Super busy. I haven't seen a Kroger this busy. What was it, like Friday afternoon? Um, so I just left. We had to go. We had somewhere to be. So really what I want there is I want to get blueberries. I want to get the brawny paper towels. I want to get the bounce dryer sheets. Um, and they have potatoes on sale and Starkist tuna. And then I want to go to Albertsons because I think they've got meat on sale. Um, they've got Chuck Roast New York Strip and boneless skinless chicken breast as well as 93% uh, lean beef and then they've got oranges and butter oh they have the brawny cheaper so let's get the brawny and albertsons all right let's go and i'll see you at kroger's was not planning on doing all of my shopping at Kroger. Y'all, I had a list. I had a list of what I was going to buy in there. But so much, there was so much clearance in this store. I never come to this location. And I don't come to this location because sometimes it can be a little sketch. Let's just be honest here. Um, but it is Sunday morning. Let's see. It is 11.05 now. That's how long I spent in there. Um, because I started going down the aisles. First, I started over in the veggies. I showed y'all a little bit. I started going down the veggies aisle, and she was marking down stuff. And, uh, so I got a bunch of marked down fresh vegetables and some fruits. Did I get fruits? I know I got fresh vegetables. I got the fruits that were on sale. And then I kept going and I kept seeing more and more and more stuff on, on uh, Markdown. Woo, so I loaded up. I spent like $80. So when we get back at the house, I'll uh, set y'all up and I'll show you what I got. I gotta make some more freezer room. All right, I gotta go get gas. And I'll meet you back at home. Okay, we are back home and I have an enormous amount of groceries to put away. So, since I found, I, you know, I found so much on sale. They were marking stuff down as I was there. So, I'm going to kind of be reaching and grabbing and, oh, so you hold on. I'm going to show you everything. So, um, let's see, where do I want to start? Where do I want to start? Sorry, I don't mind my mess. I'm cleaning. Okay, so one of the first places that I always go when I go into Kroger is they usually have a section that they have put out fruits and vegetables in these little red bags. And these are a dollar. These are 99 cents. Now, there's nothing wrong with these. I don't know why these 
get picked and put over there. I don't know if they're the end of the ones they had and now they get new ones. I, I, I don't know if there's like, they look funny. I, I don't know, but there's nothing wrong with these. And if y'all, y'all seen in the footage before that I picked up some green bell peppers and they were what, 67 cents each, but I get three yellow ones, which were over a dollar a piece for a dollar. So I got those. And then I also picked up over there uh, some squash. So these, I can tell, they look like they have been kind of beat up a little bit, So, but that's okay. They're still good. So I got two yellow squash and two zucchini. So I thought that was a really great deal. So that's the first place I always start. And there was a lady over there that was marking down so much while I was, I was steadily picking up as she was putting down. I'm going to jump around. This is going to be in no order because this was the next thing I've seen over there. And I think this is what I'm going to make for dinner tonight, like a Sunday dinner. We're going to do some uh, chicken breast. And these were marked down to $6.32. They were originally $9.71. So these are bone-in, but I thought that sounds really good just to do some, season it up and sear it and then finish it off in the oven and do it with some potatoes. So, and for that price, that was a great price. That was better than what they had on sale for the boneless. So uh, $6.71 reduced for that. Okay, we're going to keep going. And while I was over here in the veggie section, like I said, she was steadily, I'm like really close. Hi, y'all. Uh, she was steadily marking down stuff, so I got these fresh green beans. So these were marked down to $3.70. I love green beans. I can eat them raw. I can cook them. I think for Nick, because he don't care for them, I might try doing them like fried, like in the air fryer, maybe battered and fried, and see if he likes that with some ranch. So big old bag. I can try that out. And then... Oh, y'all, we, we went to Walmart yesterday, and they had still some Valentine's stuff, so Nick got a set of uh, earbuds for, I think, I think it was half, so I think it was like $4, and that was the charging cable in there, and then the Brussels sprouts, she marked them down to two twenty eight or two yeah, two twenty eight. love Brussels sprouts, again, can eat those raw or put them in the air fryer, oh, it's good stuff there. And then what else? Okay, and then for more meat market uh, things that were discounted, I got the 93% lean ground turkey. So I had picked up the ground beef that was on sale, but this was definitely a better deal. So I got two of those. I don't believe, I mean, just the stuff I got. Now there's some regular price stuff. I got celery, it wasn't on sale, and it was probably a little higher here than it would be if I went to Winto. But after I started picking up stuff, I'm like, I don't want to go anywhere else. I found so much stuff here. So I did pick up some celery. And I picked these up for Nick because I know he's going to like them. So I picked up two mangoes. <laughs> he's looking at me. I'm going to stick these in the fruit bowl that's right behind me over here. They're not quite, they need to sit out. They're not quite soft yet. But aren't they pretty? Okay, and then I got some berries because that's why I went there. Nick and I did go to another Kroger the other day, and it was super busy, and they were completely out of blueberries, like none. This store, as you see, had a ton. So I got two of these packages of blueberries. I've been loving blueberries lately. I didn't care for them much when I was younger. But these are $1.88, and it's a little big one, not that little flat one. So I got some blueberries, and then I went ahead, and I picked the strawberries that I bought. Those I've went through just about all of them, and I think they're really seedy now, and I love the smell of strawberries when they're in season, and they smell really good. So these were $2.99, not as cheap as they can be, but still not bad. And then I got some crunchy taco shells, because I figured with that ground turkey, we can make some tacos, and we haven't used the crunchy shells in a while, so I thought we'd do that. And then I also just got a package of ramen, so it was a six pack, so... When Nick is like, I'm hungry, I don't know what to eat, and ramen. I like ramen, actually. And they had pasta on sale. I don't know that I really needed any, but I went ahead and I got some spaghetti noodles. So these were 88 cents. Um, the uh, Kroger's Deluxe Mac and Cheese was on sale for a dollar and a half. So we always have a mac and cheese in the house, because even if we don't want to do anything else, we can at least make some mac and cheese. Okay, and then, let's see, I went ahead and picked up a package of taco seasoning, because I couldn't remember if I had any or not, and I picked up two uh, tuna fish. These were a dollar each, and I figured these I could grab for lunch when I don't have anything ready, so I just got a lemon pepper 
<laughs> excuse me, and a cracked black pepper. So I grabbed those. And this is something that I don't buy, but it was on clearance. The Starbucks iced coffee. I really wanted the like caramel one, but it wasn't on clearance. But this was on clearance for $2.92. So we can have some iced coffee. And then this was on sale, so I went ahead and got it. And it is the uh, real milk and cream um, vanilla vanilla cream coffee creamer and it was marked down to two dollars and 47 cents so i figured there we go we have a uh, vanilla iced coffee what do you think nick mm -hmm. yeah okay all right and then i got this was on sale so it is we definitely need this it's the pet hair bounce uh -huh. I know. <laughs> it smells so good i can smell it and these were on clearance again this is something i figured if i don't have breakfast I can grab it and take it to work. These were on sale. It is dark in here. I need a better light. But, um, yeah, it's the Strawberry and Cream Quaker, the little instant pack. I don't buy that a lot, but... All right, I think this is what Nick's standing over here waiting for and looking at me. The cookies were $2.99 if you bought two packs. So this one's my favorite, the Chips Ahoy Chew. And then this is the one that Nick wanted when we went to the other store, which is the family size of the Oreo. So is that what you're waiting on? Okay. All right, <laughs> go away. Oh, okay. He's standing here. Oh, look at this, Nick. Look what I got. Okay, one. Just sitting a bit little here, standing there. I got spices. Y'all know how expensive spices are, unless you're getting like the 97 cent no name ones. So I got all spice, which I like putting when I make ground meat dishes. So it was a dollar ninety three. And I got cream of tartar, which y'all know how expensive cream of tartar can be. And it was two oh two. And here's another one somewhere. Did I drop it? I picked these up because I've never bought this brand. And I see some of y'all buy this that live like over towards Georgia. I think Meech and Monica brought this brand. It's the Country Boys. Uh, they call it connected sausage. We call it smoked sausage. But it is cheese breakfast sausages. Ooh. And look how the size of those. Don't those look good? Mm -hmm. I think those with some scrambled eggs would be really good in the morning for breakfast with some toast. So there we go. So these were on sale for $3.99. And then this. Look at this. We've tried this brand a couple of times. It's the Rana. And this is the family size lasagna. So, it is a family size meat lasagna, and y'all, this was marked down to $6.30. We tried um, a pasta dish over at my older kid's house, and then Nick and I picked up something. Was it the lasagna? Or we've had something from theirs before, um, and it's really good, and especially for that price. I think it's normally double that. So, and I mean, these are kept in the dairy case, but you can totally put this in the freezer and then just defrost it and cook it if you're not going to cook it right away. This will be a perfect crock pot meal. It is made by Tyson, but it's a pork roast with vegetables. So I make beef roast all the time, but this is a pork roast. It was $5.85. I just thought that was like a really great price, and that's the perfect size for Nick and I. So totally, probably tomorrow because he's home. I will put this in the crock pot and just let it cook all day long, and then dinner will be done tomorrow night when I get home. So we'll season it up and add some seasoning to it. But I thought that was a really good deal. I couldn't believe all of the carrot stuff. Okay, so the one thing they did not have, have you ever seen me buy this? No. Yeah, they did not have half gallons of milk. And the fact they didn't have gallons of milk, and he started putting it up as I started walking away. Uh, so I got the Simple Truth um, Organic Reduced 2% Milk. I never buy this. I mean, we buy cow's milk, um, but I never buy this brand. This was expensive, almost $4. But I got the Zero Sugar Tropicana. Uh, this is called Summer Splash. And we always have some sort of juice in there. And Nick don't like it, but I usually try to get zero sugar as much as I can. <laughs> Okay, and then I got, and I have to hide this in the refrigerator somewhere, or I'll wake up one morning and it'll all be gone. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, but I got some Cool Whip, and uh, yeah, for the fruit, for the coffee, for all sorts of stuff. So, just got some Cool Whip. Car. But I was out of vegetable oil, so I picked up some vegetable oil. And I think, oh, and I got some potatoes. I'm a potato! Got some potatoes. So, these were a dollar and a half. So, the price of potatoes has finally went down. So, I think for dinner tonight, we're going to do that bone-in chicken breast and uh, some mashed potatoes, and I'll finish that off. I'm gonna do, I've got this chicken breast. It's bone in, skin on chicken breast. So for supper, I'm gonna fry it, pan fry it, season it, pan fry it, and finish it in the oven, do some mashed potatoes, and maybe I'll do some fresh green beans or some Brussels sprouts or something with us, and we'll have a big old dinner. 
and uh, Nick just gave me a cookie. So that's it. Now I got to put all this stuff away, and I'm tired. So thank you for coming grocery shopping with me. Y'all get out there. If y'all go to Kroger or your grocery store and you find some really good deals, go ahead and let me know what you find. Um, I've been watching people score like all sorts of stuff at Kroger's for the longest, and the one I normally go to just rarely has this many things on I on sale. So maybe. Sunday mornings is the time to go. But I hope y'all have an absolutely amazing week. Y'all remember to thank God for today because it truly is a gift. And I will see you in the next video. Bye! <laughs> Bye, y'all. Don't forget, like, subscribe, and leave me a comment so we can chit-chat down below.